Episode 47, The Power of Connection. Awaken the leader inside. Follow the path of leadership. Never give up. Never stop trying. Get up. Believe in yourself. Not every day is going to be easy, but you've got to challenge yourself. You need courage. Be ready. Stop waiting for it to happen. Go make it happen. Harness the power within. You are destined to be a leader. Follow the path of leadership. Awaken the leader inside. Episode 47. The Power of Connection. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Dave Rubalcava and I'm your host here at Awaken the Leader Inside, a show dedicated to your leadership journey. Remember, you are never alone. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to another episode. And if this is your first time, I appreciate you guys finding the podcast. Today, I want to share something that happened to me this past week that really helped me understand the power of connection, which I think is so important as a leader that you understand that you the way you connect with people and how you motivate and inspire people can become the fuel that you're going to need to re-energize yourself. And for me, that happened to me this past week. So I had the chance of being a keynote speaker at Orange Grove Middle School in uh, Hacienda Heights. And uh, it was an amazing experience to be able to stand in front of 430 plus students and talk about my journey and talk about, you know, the hardships that I've overcome and how we have to to have courage to find success. And so it was just a great experience. And not only did I have a chance to to speak in front of them, but I had a chance to actually spend time with the students in a classroom setting where I got to show them you know, some of the videos and some of the projects that we've been working on and just be able to do questions and answer sessions with them. And it was such a great lesson Uh, For me, of how important it is to connect, especially with young adults, which honestly, my show is is more geared towards, you know, professionals in their careers were basically adults, you know, so I didn't I didn't never really thought about even connecting uh, with with young adults, but I got this opportunity and 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 it changed me. So if you guys want to watch that video, I'll send I'll leave a link in here in the notes, but I think it's uh it was pretty cool. It was it was, it was something that I'm I'm proud of and it was a cool moment for me in my own growth. So what I wanted to share with you guys is that, you know, how, the way that we connect with people can truly make a difference in your growth. And I and for me personally, and I love to share my own journey because I think a lot of us can relate to this is that simply sometimes you just don't know. And even in even in you know this project that you know the the podcast and the website sometimes I really don't know either like how deep it's connecting with people. I mean I see the downloads and that's that's amazing, but to be able to be with them with these these students these young adults and to see it instantly uh, the excitement about uh, how how the project is going how I started the podcast you know how how difficult was it uh, what did I do when I felt like I wanted to give up and I shared a lot of that I said there almost every day I felt like I wanted to give up because I didn't feel like anyone was listening but I knew I knew at some point people would find this show and they would connect with it. And so it was really interesting as as you connect with people to understand that they're just as hungry as you are and they may need guidance to to achieve those goals. And that's really what leadership is about. So for me it was very humbling. I mean, I left that ex- I left that day feeling like wow, that was that was amazing. And so, I mean, I encourage anyone that has ever been given an opportunity to go to a career day and, and speak with students and, and share what you do. I encourage you guys to do that because when I left that day, I realized something changed in me. And I realized that connecting with young adults was was never on my radar. And, uh, and now it is because I had so much fun. And they're the future of this country. But what it made me realize is that the same thing happens to us in our careers. Like we we need some we need to know sometimes that we're doing the right things and that we're getting uh, people uh, developed and helping them, you know, be successful in their career. But that doesn't always happen. But when it does, it's such an invigorating surge of energy 
to know that you're on the right track. And so, and that's kind of what I wanted to share today because I realized that many of us go through this hurdle where we, we're not sure if we're doing the right thing or we're not sure about the impact of what we're doing. And to know that that's okay and that's normal, keep pushing forward because that day will come. That day will come that you will know that you are making a difference. Uh, and and it, that happened to me. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And, and something else happened to me later that day because I handed out business cards. I handed out bracelets, those, you know, rubber band bracelets that uh, the kids wanted. So we handed out those too. But I actually got a phone call that night. And this is why I wanted to share it because this is how it, it really it really impacted me is I got a phone call that same night from one of the students just telling me that they had listened to the show and that they were truly inspired by the podcast and that they they now want to become a podcaster. So and to me that was just like wow, I don't, I'm not sure if I even get that response from adults, let alone, you know, a, a young adult in middle school to call me and leave me something like that. So it truly moved me. And, and, uh, you know, like I said, I, I've come to realize that on this journey of leadership, you got to be open to new experiences. You got to be open to new doors to connect with people because your leadership is going to help people. Your leadership is not only going to help you grow, but something like this event helped me grow because I had never really spoke with young adults or middle school students. I've never done that before. And to be honest with you, I was a little nervous about how the message would connect with them, um, you know, versus with adults. And it was very, it was a great learning experience, but it was very rewarding to make that connection. And it taught me something about my own leadership that day. And, and I got to have fun. I mean, that's the whole thing, right? We're, we're leaders and we deal with difficult challenges, but we got to have some fun sometimes. And we got to just enjoy being able to connect with people because it's so powerful. So I want to leave you with this, you guys. Every day is a challenge. Every day is going to be a hurdle that's going to require your leadership to overcome. But never forget the audience. Never forget who's listening. Never never forget who's looking to your leadership and modeling your leadership. Because that, that is the key to developing them, is to set the expectation high of yourself. And then lead by example. And to remember how important that connection with these other leaders is going to be for you. And for me, it was a very, very humbling day. Very uh, almost emotional, like I said, at the end of the day after I got that call. And it helped me realize the power of connection. So, um, And so with that, I want to tell you guys, this journey has been amazing with you guys. And thank you guys for joining the Atlee Nation, our our Facebook group. I truly appreciate it. Thank you for all the messages and the DMs that you guys send me. I truly appreciate it. Thank you for following me on Twitter, you know, Instagram, Facebook, Awaken the Leader. I appreciate all of the love. And I'm going to tell you right now, we are on a journey and our project is growing. We officially became Team Rubalcava LLC uh, and officially recognized by the state of California. So you have been on this journey that we started this, this show And like I said, a year ago with maybe 10 downloads a month, I mean, it wasn't really happening, but because of you, the show has grown into what it is now. And, you know, just, I just want to tell you that I'm super grateful for you following me on this journey. I'm grateful for you being a part of it. And there's some big things that are coming down the pipeline, you know, like we have an online course of how to get promoted that's getting ready to be released. And it's it's exciting to see a dream that we had a year ago turn into this right now and the opportunities are opening. But I want to tell you that you can do the same thing. You can open your own doors and follow whatever passions you have. It just takes leadership to remove the obstacles. And so I just want to tell you guys, thank you so much. I appreciate everything you can that you guys do. And you are the future leaders of this world. So make a difference, connect with people, 
and never forget how powerful it is to make a difference in someone else's life. Until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Stay tuned for another episode. Always remember, awaken the leader inside.